Next, we have Sai Smaran. Hello, Sai. Can you please start your video? Hello, sir. Hi. Hello, everyone. Hey, Sai. So, Sai has created an IoT-enabled mask that could uh, solve some of the basic problems that we face while wearing the mask. So, over to you, Sai. You can go ahead with your presentation. Yes, sir. Thank you. So, hello everyone. My name is Sai Smaran, studying in class 10th of St. Joseph Central, Mysore, Karnataka. I am a student of Makers Dunia and I have taken part in Python, C coding, and Arduino programming. So, I am interested in, interested in ROS, that is robotic, uh, robotics, related to robotics. So, I have made an IoT mask. My idea is being featured on TEDx as well. So, what is mask and why do we need to wear a mask? Mask is normally worn on the face for protection. Masks are barriers that help to prevent respiratory droplets from reaching others. Wearing a mask will help to prevent the spread of infection and infectious germs. When someone coughs or sneezes, they could release some germs in the air that may infect many people. So I've created this mask. So what is IoT? And what are the common components used in IoT projects? IoT means Internet of Things. Internet of Things is referred to as Internet connected to objects that are able to collect and transfer data over a wireless technology without any human being. The common, the common components used in IoT projects are Raspberry Pi, ESP8266, NodeMCU, and Adafruit. So what is Bluetooth? And what are the common Bluetooth modules used in projects? Bluetooth wireless technology used for exchange data between fixed mobile device on a short range. The main drawback for Bluetooth is that the, it can be used in a short distances, whereas IoT can be used in a longer range. The common components are HC05 Bluetooth module, ESP32 inbuilt, Bluetooth and Wi-Fi, and Bluetooth pen drives. So now, We'll speak about my IoT mask. So the main reason behind to create this IoT mask is that the normal mask or the surgical mask which we wear, we get a fog thing on our spectacles, which leads to many problems while driving or walking on streets. My mask is IoT enabled and internet of things connected to my Wi-Fi, or we can use our own internet connection. If in case, if there's any network issues or any signal problems, we can switch it into an offline mode. My mask is in the prototyping stage. I'm converting this into a product now. So these are some of my clicks of my IoT mask and Bluetooth circuits. So I have done this mask in two variants. So I've done this mask in two variants. One is in uh, IoT and one is in Bluetooth. So this is my circuit. I'm working on various embedded systems also. This is a ESP32 chip. So I'll be showing the working of this Bluetooth mask. I have created an app for this. I'm using the Blink app for this. Then see that the fan starts running. When I press off, it's getting off. Uh, so you you may think that the mask is too big and cannot be worn. So this is just a prototype. I'm uh, collaborating with various robotic companies and uh, I'm working on it to make small and more compact. So now I'm open for questions. Hello, Sai. 
yes sir so that was wonderful and it was amazing to see a prototype and such a good project you also mentioned about you uh, like you showcased your work at tedx you so can you yes, share sir. your experience about that tedx uh, event uh yes sir uh, tedx event uh, was a virtual event where the, where there's a platform we could speak on our own ideas so i spoke on my iot mask and uh, mr uh, sir ramana ramanan ramanathan sir also spoke on my iot mask for one minute he appreciated the work uh, that i uh, have done so oh, so that's thing that's all sir and what all other projects you are working on so now i'm basically working on this mask uh, i'm taking a lot of problems and then uh, i i'll be solving the problems in the future days and all uh like if you want to share some of your projects like any ideas your future innovation that you are working on sir now i'm working on my mask now later i'll be working on iot drones and all ah okay that that is more fascinating to see so uh, like have you tried your mask uh, or like your this prototype of iot enabled mask with actual public oh, yes sir like, i have uh, also tried uh, yes sir yeah. i have asked my friends to wear and all they said they, they also said that uh, your mask is big you need to work on that to make it small and compact and i have also sh- showed to my cousins and all ah okay okay that is one of good all right so i even like notice you you were featured like you were from uh, appreciated by one of a indian politician can you share that experience as well uh yes sir uh, i also went to uh, tejasvi surya he is a mp of bangalore uh, i also went there i told about my mask i asked uh, help from him and all he said he'll be helping me uh, in the future months uh, he said he'll be funding for that and all ah okay that is what about so say how old you are what's your age sir i'm studying in 10th i'm 15 years old ah okay okay that's great that's why you uh, love electronics and all and you're creating projects yes, that could solve a lot of problems yes sir so uh like why did you got the idea how maybe how did you got the idea of creating iot enabled uh, mask yes What, sir uh, my, yes sir i'll tell my job so my cousin used to wear a mask where he used to get fog thing on his spectacles and uh, he said uh, he's, uh, he's facing a lot of problems Uh, so i i when i joined makers dunia i learned a lot of things i learned a lot of things i understood concepts on uh, c coding and uh, python so i took some of the libraries uh, i learned a lot of libraries uh, in makers dunia so so like that i started up with my mask and i created this mask and what sort of problems you face initially like uh... Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, for uh, like, I wasted a lot of components. I burned them. I literally like so uh, desoldered them. I don't know what happened to. I literally wasted around five to six components, ESP components. Yeah, that that is pretty common in electronics. Like, the things yes, get sir. easily burned. Yes, sir. And I burnt my hand also. Oh, okay. So like, you would be walking with all the safety equipments before. Uh, soldering and before connecting the blackberry equipment together yes sir yes all right so uh, i can also i was also wondering is this mask uh, pretty pretty uh, pretty comfortable on the face uh, yes sir it's uh, it's a comfortable one and uh, uh, every uh, like all people say that uh, what in, if in case if there's any corona coming uh, like any virus coming inside because there's a fan here uh, it can pull out so uh, i have used the purifier here which also helps in purifying the air and i am working on this so that it can be removed any time and can be stuck every uh, any time so i am working on that also okay and i like also see that you uh, we were supposed to control this mask using your application so can yes, you just show me the interface of your app maybe like what all the app look like how and how it will yes, control the mask i'm using a blink app all right i've built this and uh, uh, for the for iot and for bluetooth i have created this app 
okay and like how the app would give commands to the mask sir uh, the, uh, like the iot mask acts like a wireless technology uh, which is connected to wifi these both are interfaced at uh, one one interface so that i could uh, use like connect this both at uh, one interface and then i can turn on okay. turn off i have a more question let's, let's assume like you are in a room where maybe 10 to 15 or maybe more than that people are wearing the same iot enabled mask so like will it be possible if a person can control some other person's mask like will that uh, no, create sir. interference in the thing when you try to uh, like give command to your own mask sir the, that won't be possible because uh, uh, like while coding i need to give ssid and uh, password uh, details uh, at that point of time i can give any other passwords ah okay will like, be different for to... each one okay it's like there's a single communication channel for every uh, device yes sir yes ah oh, that is wonderful sign so like i'm amazed to see your project meanwhile if any other panelists if you have any other question please feel free to ask all right sign i hope that i think there's no questions so that was pretty wonderful and thank you for showcasing your innovation over here thank you sir all right sign have a good day